Hello, I'm Eric, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Portland. Today, I'm going to show you how you can combine a wildcard with the principal element and an explicit deny in an Amazon Simple Storage Service Bucket policy. Let's get started. Your first thought might be to use a wildcard with the not principal element in your policy. However, wildcards are not supported with the not principal element. Let me show you what you can do instead. First, after logging into the AWS Management Console, navigate to the S3 console. Then, select the bucket you want to restrict access to. From here, select the Permissions tab and scroll down to the Bucket Policy section. Select Edit. Now I'm going to copy and paste a policy that grants access to one specific AWS Identity and Access Management role from my own AWS account and denies all other IAM principles access to the bucket. The first policy block grants list bucket permissions to the role, while the second policy block grants delete, get, and put object permissions. The last policy block is where the magic happens. It combines an explicit deny with a wildcard principle. This would deny all IAM principles, but we use a condition statement to allow the desired IAM role. The deny applies only if the AWS user ID string is not like the following value. We can retrieve the desired user ID value using the AWS CLI. Use the command git role and provide the name of the role. We want the role ID value. We then add a wildcard to the user ID value to include all possible names passed by differing calling processes such as applications, services, or instance IDs. Finally, we include an AWS account number as part of the condition. This should be the account that the IAM principle we allowed earlier belongs to. This makes sure that we are denying access from any other AWS account. Select Save Changes, and we are done. So now you know how to combine wildcards with a principal element and an explicit deny in an Amazon S3 bucket policy. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.